Hi everyone, it's Annette here from Sweet Pea and I'm joined today by, with Emma, our designer digitizer, who's designed this wonderful new release, the Harvest Quilt. Harvest Quilt. It's awesome, Emma. Yes, so my inspiration for it was basically to go more traditional, so a more traditional sort of quilt to celebrate autumn and the harvest. So we have, I think there are 12 blocks in total for the quilt and then there's we've got an extra little block um, so we've got sunflowers little truck carrying pumpkins so these are done in two separate blocks Emma yes so okay. there's a bit so you can see a bit more detail yeah and then so there's squares so all the blocks are done in squares so squares, different yeah. sizes so what's so the sizes that it comes in are four by four five by five six by six and seven by seven yeah but they join up perfectly the way you have it you yeah. digitize it so that it's um Easy yeah. to join, sort yeah. of, isn't so it? So you've only got to join the the, ba the the grass and the bottom of the truck. Yeah. Okay, so you've got sunflowers, the truck. Pumpkin, kitty, bird, um, a long house, and then you've got a little, a little house down here. And it also comes with two types of borders. So if you want okay. to yeah, add, yeah. add sashing or borders to your quilt, you can use those. There's two different types so it's basically so basically you've picked all the sort of images that you think of when you think about harvest autumn autumn yeah and even farm life in general isn't yeah it? oh yeah oh this would the fabrics that we've used for our quilt are um, reproduction fabrics so sort of oldie worldy sort of more traditional style kind of yeah. fabrics so, but this could look totally different with oh, more yeah, it's modern. Of, could more, be if it was bright, you can make it a really modern. Oh, you yeah, could go country, like yeah. use buffalo check and all sorts of things. Yeah. And the beauty yeah. with these things is you can you don't have to make a quilt with these blocks. No. So, if you particularly like the sunflower blocks, you could make a whole quilt or table runner or cushions, pillows with them. Yeah. Pumpkins. Yes. The flowers. Houses, you can make a whole bunch of houses and have them in a row and make a bench cushion if you like. Yeah. Yeah, there's... your imagination. It, yeah. That it's, yeah, you can do everything. So. so there's a bit of a different construction to the, the quilt too with this yes, one, Yes, this one's a little bit different. So we've got uh, flat piping. So in our instructions, we have sort of instructions on how to calculate how much you need and how to put them on your quilt. Um, this quilt hasn't got binding. It is done in using a method called bagging out so if we've added borders but what you do is you put your backing on the top and then you stitch around it and then you turn it right side out okay That's... wow so it's just a quicker way if you yeah, it's a different technique isn't yeah it? it's just a quicker way of doing it but there's so many different ways to do a quilt so but this is just yeah, another some, way yeah people have their favorite ways but it's good to use these opportunities with these designs as they come out to actually learn a new technique so with this technique you'd learn this this way of flat piping yep you don't need to do it if, if that sort of thing doesn't appeal to you or you know um, you could leave it off yes. and you can make the quilt however you like but yeah. it's it is a good way to learn yeah. new techniques that you can use in another projects yeah so um if you did want to add bi binding to this quilt we do have that included in the instructions as well so yeah there at the end so this is our harvest quilt yes 12 different blocks Emma yes with a free add-on add -on block. block little a little dog to match your little cat so maybe if you weren't a cat person, you could substitute the cat for the dog. So this is a free add-on block that you'll get when you purchase the design. Yes. That's a really good idea, yeah. Emma. I don't know why there'd be no, you know, cat lovers, but you know. Well, you could have both. You might like yeah, cats and dogs. Can. Yes, exactly. So they're, they're so cute. I love them. Well done, Emma. This is another wonderful quilt to add to your library. Yes. Thanks, everyone. Bye.